hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel in this video we are going to discuss about the tableau scenario based question which were asked to me in one of the top product based company so without wasting any further time let's move to the questions the first question is find out the customer who has returned the max number of products in its region okay so to break down this for this we need customers from each region okay first let's drag region and we need customers as well right okay and after that who has returned max number of products for this we need count of product and as we don't have product id here for this we'll use product name okay we'll add here and change it to distant count okay and sort it out okay so for this we need who has returned for this we have one table that is returned and for this we'll use in the filter and we'll use yes okay so as you can see these are the customer who has returned the maximum product from each reason okay now we need to show only max customer from each reason okay for this we'll use our method that is we'll create an index add it here okay and now let's change it to compute using customer name why are we are doing it now we are dividing the index based on the custom from each region okay let's say there are 37 customer in each in central region after that it will start from one okay now let's drag this index into filter as well unselect all and select only one because we need the max we need only one customer so these are the customers that return max number of product from each region okay we can hide that as well but there is a catch let's say there are few customers that return the similar same number of product from same reason okay let me give you an example let me remove this and here as well here this is seven and then six six okay and here 13 14 8 7 5 5 7 6 6 okay if you look at the west these are the two customers who has returned the 11 11 customers from each region okay but we only showed anthony johnson because of their data source order okay that's why it's picked only one but both the customers had returned max number of products so how we can show that both customers who has returned the same number of product okay so for this we, we will create one more calculated field and use our function dense rank okay dense rank or in tableau we called it rank dense okay so if you not if you are not aware about what is rank and dense rank you can read it from here if if there is a customer which has the same number it will return the both okay and assign the same rank to them for this let's say we are using count the count dt of product name and we need them into descending order okay and click on okay now drag it here and change it to discrete value and compute using customer name now let's add this dense rank into the filter and select only one and click on ok now let's hide it so now you can see and now we get the both the customers who has returned the 11 year product from the west west region ok so this is how you can solve this problem now let's move to the second question how to reset all filters by single button 
for this let's drag customer name with sales and drag let's say i'm using category and then not here here select all okay now we'll create one more sheet and add the text here that is the reset button okay we have the reset button here now now let's change it if we change to polygon remove it we don't want its label okay we you can do the formatting and remove this line as well okay i just created here now you can just drag this here we don't want its title and we can add this button here as well let me just show its filter category and subcategory okay you can make it more dynamic by using the floating okay i'm just doing it just for your reference how we can do that okay now we have added the filter and we have added our both the sheets as well okay now we'll go to the dashboard go to actions okay now add action and filter at what basis we want to clear the filters that is sheet 3 okay then remove q2 because this is our source sheet and our target sheet is customer name only sheet that is our q2 okay and from here we we'll use the select and that is exclude all values okay and here we'll use the selected field that is our filter category subcategory okay and click on okay okay let me just made some changes here okay and if you click here you can see all the filter will be resetted let's try it again now let me remove furniture and office supplies from here okay if you click on this again you can see the all the filters into initial stage and all the filter get resetted okay so this is how you can reset all the filters by using single button i think that's it for this video thank you so much guys if you like the video please do like share and subscribe and stay tuned for upcoming videos